Hello ladies and gentlemen, in today's Valkyrie Camera Spots video, I am going to be doing the map bank, and I have added new effects and such, whatever you would prefer to call them, just new clip types to make the video look better overall, overall, yes. Now. I hope you all enjoy that, but um, if you do wish to join me when I'm making a video, such as glitch videos, because my nat is no longer moderate and it's strict again, hooray, just friend my account Fullbring and I will try to get you in if possible, and friend my, friend my Nixie account if you wish to join me in ranked. Now, to all those people that have messaged me pretty recently, just please understand that um, I have been binge watching fairy tale, you know. Oh, I like anime. Yes, so let's get right into the video. All enemies have been eliminated. So as you can see, that was one of the new things I'm trying. But um, yes, you're gonna want to aim around this general area and throw the camera. But if you throw it actually so that it is closer to the top side then it's a lot more hidden to people that are outside but yes this is a pretty overall useful camera if you are protecting CEO office and it is not retrievable obviously now for this camera spot you just wanna run outside this is for the pesky people that check out skylight and now you wanna run outside look up here and throw your camera towards the fence now this is not a terrible glitch this isn't a glitch at all. I mean, unless you want to consider whatever I just did a glitch. That's, no, that's not a glitch. It's just a good way to watch people that are up top. Since your camera is behind the fence, people will not really see the camera. So, yes, that is that spot. Now let's evolve to a next spot at the same exact area. So, this one is if you want to watch inside so just throw the camera and not absolutely fail like I just did and this time we'll do it, throw it with a plan so throw it while you're looking around that area and it will get up there, yes it will get up there happily ever after now people will not be focusing up there when they are sitting um, down here if they are ever to come to where I am as an attack because I mean why would they look up into skylight they're field of view wouldn't be focused on that specific area. Now, let's get on to the next area. There is another. So, if you want to protect this room, then you're going to want to throw your camera right here. Now, this camera can only see into the room, not the um, entrance to the room. I will show another camera for the entrance. So as you can see here, you can see pretty much the entire room right here. You can see the entire cafeteria, yes. Now, it's obviously retrievable, but if you want to watch the entrance, then throw your camera up here, like I do, as shown. Now, it does show the entrance, that entrance, and also over at archives. Now, this camera is retrievable, I'll show that later, but, um, yes, now... This camera is pretty cool, you sprint outside and throw your camera up here while aiming at that portion of the window. Now you can see a lot outside. If you prefer to throw it from an objective window, I'd say, then this is your number one cam. But let's go speedy speed and skip all the way over here. This camera is retrievable if you don't um, completely and utterly fail. So assuming that you don't like to die, as I did sadly, then you would want to come out of this door and aim straight up, like as far as you can up, and it would land on this corner here, like so. Now, this camera is pretty cool, I mean, if you, if people saw you coming to this door, they would be scared that you, um, would be prepared to throw that camera over the fence, but, um, I mean, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. That, that can get you banned, and getting banned is no good. So, next spot. 
pizzazz. Now, this one is if you want to watch the flank hallway, so just lean to the left and throw the camera right here. It is pretty pretty well hidden seeing as how you cannot see it from absolutely anywhere unless you go up to the wall and actually look at it. But it's obviously retrievable. Now for this one we're going to use the same exact thing as the open area spot, but just on the other side. Now it can see quite a lot, you know, entrance, entrance, and everything else, but if you want to retrieve it you have got to go do what I do. Not, not uh, super speed again, not the exact thing, but just do this, just shoot out this portion of floor if you want to retrieve it. So, as you can see, I'm gonna retrieve it and yawn because I don't know, it's 10 a.m. and I haven't really slept yet. So, next spot. If you want to watch the um, flank room, like you're positive that your teammates won't be able to hold off the enemies and they'll actually be able to push this room, you know, just sit in here, just throw the can, now it's retrievable, but if it for some reason isn't, just shoot that whole thing down and the camera will fall to the ground. Now if you're positive that your teammates can keep off the push, just throw a cam up here and you'll be able to see everything. Absolutely everything. Now if you want to watch like a lower perspective, just throw it on top of this one right here and yes you will get that lower um, perspective. Now, we are doing the last objective, so come on to this couch if you want to watch the hallway. Now, you want to throw a camera into the lamp, like so. Now, let's just crouch so that you can see past my head. So you can see pretty much anything that that camera right above it can, and it's pretty well hidden since it's right beside a light source. And if people were to go push up to look for the camera, you know, because they suspect that there's one, they wouldn't really see it unless they came onto the couch. So, next spot. Now this one sort of depends on how you throw it on what you want to watch. So if you throw it, like, directly in the center, then you could only see the doorway. But if you want to see more than just the doorway... I'm yawning again, Jesus Christ! Okay, so pick up the camera. This means it's retrievable, but um, throw it on one side. So I threw it more to the left, and that means that I'm going to see more of this side. Now, if you pick it up again and throw it more to the right, that would mean oh Jesus, I uh, I just had a heart attack. Oh, that hurt. I had a heart spasm attack. Okay, so yes. Now let's watch the garage. So go prone and throw your camera under here, and not absolutely screw up like me. Second try. Oh, third time's a charm. Okay, well that's good enough, you know. That's good enough. Okay. So, since their field of view wouldn't be focused on this specific area, this camera is a pretty good location for a garage. So, if I wasn't focusing on that area, I would be focusing around the corner to see if there was enemies. I know people probably had already droned it out, but um... That will be it for this cool video. Now drop a like or a dislike based on what you thought of the spots and just please leave some feedback on what you thought of my effects. So farewell. I've been holding on.